All right, your three insane difficulty walkthrough for WikiGameGuides.com. I'm gonna start off right on the bat. We just got out of the tunnels. Yeah, we just uh, we ended the last video talking about how the scenery looks good. It actually yeah. kind of does. I mean, it does have jagged edges, but every 360 game is gonna have that because 360s graphics aren't that powerful. No, I was I was just referring to how like you've been in like dark caves and stuff all this time, and now you're finally out in like the sunshine and stuff. It looks really good. Yeah, it uh, especially like um, of course uh, the pre-rendered cutscenes they look excellent. Like um, the first game that I actually saw that seemed real in cutscenes was Bioshock. Uh, you played the first one, right? Yeah, I I I I I, I double. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't complete it. <laughs> well, like at the very end of the game, if you get the good ending, it shows like a like a human hand that looks literally real. Um, and the, the same thing with this. Um, the pre-rendered cutscenes look fabulous. I, I I don't know how to describe it. it. Just looks amazing. Yeah. So when I brought up that question earlier about um how long it took you, I was referring to like um. How long of a game is it? If you play it run and gun, it's gonna be a lot shorter. But um, <sighs> did they throw that grenade back at you? Ye they might have. Mm. But uh, yeah, if you play a run and gun, it's gonna be a lot shorter. Um, but if you play on the harder difficulties and you stay back, it's gonna run you eight to ten hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is well, that sounds cool. Yeah. Yeah, I uh, died once there. Yeah, Actually, no, so I get it. I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, screw you. <laughs> this, this part was actually, it took me really long because on Fearless, I beat this the first time. But um, on this, it took me freaking forever because they kept flanking me and just tricking me out and stuff. You got a like, you got a like bullet storm kick going on in this game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love the. Uh, it feels really smooth and the melee combat in this game. Yeah. Ah, uh, I wish I was finished school like you were. Yeah, it's it's pretty nice. So I gotta go to school every day. It sucks. It's a miracle that I even got the Duke Nukem guide done. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, wow, you are just um freaking tearing shit up in this game. There's a lot of explosions, a lot of gore and blood. Actually, when you run up there, um, that spawns a whole another wave of guys. So I just uh -huh. like to come back here. <laughs> um, yeah, there, there's a lot of blood going on. Oh yeah, wait till you see um, some of like the uh, further down the road, uh, some of like the Elmiverse sections. Um, like wow. there's one where blood covers like the whole floor. Huh. And like the sea turns into blood and stuff. It's there's a lot of different things. And the sky turns into blood, and then we realize that Alma's alive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, every time we see her, we see her like really young. Like she's like yeah. nine years old. Uh, she's actually like pregnant right now, and that's what the whole game is about. Mm. Or something. And I'm not gonna spoil yeah. the ending because we'll see that at the end of the guide. But um. Yes, yeah, something. There's there's a plot twist that leaves like a cliffhanger. I think I still want to pick up this game, so I don't think I want to watch too much of the cutscenes. Yeah, well, I'm basically not going to be narrating the cutscenes, so you won't see yeah. it. Those. Yeah. You'll just see the the gameplay. Oh, and make sure yeah. to use my guide. <laughs> oh, the um, yeah, I might. <laughs> to to be honest, I did use your L.A. Noir when I got stuck, so. Oh, thank you. <sighs> yep. Well, I also told you when you were like, yeah, because I'm fucking awesome. That's the... <laughs> you didn't really respond like that. But <laughs> yeah. Um, another death right there. So I'm just going to keep, like... You, you're having the same problem. I keep getting the, uh, like, loading screen there just once. For one second. Yeah. Um, I fixed it by... Uh, the crossfade puts it over uh, the edit. It puts it, like, right over the the line of the edit like right in the middle so what I do is I push it over from the left and then I push it in from the right so that it's more on the second video and then it it, it stopped it well that's what I found anyway yeah. 
Uh, really quick here, um, pick out this. I like to take the sniper. Um, please, for the love of God, if you're playing this on insane, do not take cover behind this balcony. Just kind of make. Don't even take cover. Just kind of crouch, because these guys will chuck a ton of grenades at you, and you're not gonna have enough time to get out of cover and run back inside, because it's gonna be between be between you and the door. So. Why ain't you getting grenades right now? Because they can't see you. Ah, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's something to do with the like, cover. This cover system. Like, if you're in cover, then yeah. they won't chuck them. The sniper rifle sort of looks like the sniper rifle off, uh... Yeah, yeah, it sort of looks like the sniper rifle off Black Ops a little bit. Kind of reminds me of the one from Bulletstorm, like the way it zooms in and everything. Yeah. Looks like a sweet sniper, it absolutely kills them in one. Yeah. It's ridiculous. It, it, it is redonkulous. Redonkulous. <laughs> I don't think there's many pe I don't think there's anyone in this part. To be honest, this pistol sort of looks like the one. Well, it looks a little bit like the one from. More, it looks more futuristic, actually. It uh, looks like something that should be in Halo. It, it kind of like does look like the, the pistol, Halo 2 pistol. Yeah. I was going to say it looked a little bit like the one from Homefront, but. Yeah. And, and there's my third one. Yeah. Um, here, going to slow mo kill those guys at the top there or at least try and damage them. One of those guys will jump down. Um, you can kill him on the way down. Cool. And yeah, because now that they're taking their battle stations, I guess you could call it. Um, so you definitely want to uh, get them, get them kind of injured before they get into cover. Uh-huh. Um, do they all like I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Oh, sorry. I'm talking about the wrong thing. Um, <laughs> is it the same creators of like from the first game all the way to this game, or is it um, different? Actually, the creators of this game uh, they helped make the first and second, but they were just kind of side developers. Um, this is their first actually full-fledged game, I think. So, who are the uh, developers behind this then? Uh, this is Day One Studios. I forget who the first people were. I know Warner Brothers published this. Yeah, I know that. I think. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know who made it. I could wiki it right now. Yeah. Why don't you do that really quick? Um, really quick. Uh, shoot those barrels, cause if they get shot, um, even once, then they're going to eventually explode, and that killed me multiple times. Mm. So. Mo Monolith Productions. Monolith. Well, yeah. They. Quite well known. They they made the first two. Second one was complete crap, but why? I don't know. I just hated it. I couldn't it play it. Seemed good. I just, I don't know. I I hated it. I didn't continue playing it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, Manalith uh, made one and two in the expansion packs, I think. Yeah. Oh yeah, a guy will pop out of that door once you've completed, or once you've killed everyone else, and then there's a guy in the basement down those steps, so throw a grenade and kill him. Oh, that's cheap. <laughs> huh. <laughs> uh, that, that is cheap. So as soon as you turn that corner, what, he's got like a shotgun or something? Yeah, he'll just kind of pop out of the door, and that opens up the next area. You were talking shit to me the whole time on Skype because you were failing at this game. Oh god, when I fail and I keep dying, I get in a terrible mood and I'll just be a total dick. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I, I, I'm like, yeah, well, keep getting it. Well, sorry, keep playing and you'll get it. Well, well and you're like, yeah, we'll keep playing and keep getting it. You keep playing and you'll get it. <laughs> you're just being a dick to me the whole time. Yeah, I was I, like, <laughs> what, 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 what the hell did did I do? <laughs> Don't take it personally, it's just the game talking <laughs> through me. <laughs> so, this is coming up to the, the end, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, we are pretty much at the end of this video. I'll just cut the commentary here, because we're almost done. So, thanks for watching, right. hope you enjoyed, and hope this has helped.